is this? Get him out of here. I got this. Don't be cross with me, Father. I couldn't leave you at the mercy of these savages. You not do that, you fleshy toad! You nearly hit him. Since the time of the Founding Fathers, dark forces have been preying on America. As the fight against these vampires continued, a secret organization has trained people with remarkable skills. The agent's duty is to protect ordinary people from the forces of evil. Nunzu chatty with his gut sprayed all over a train carriage. I know how to shape an explosion, Edgar. It's coming. Wait for it. about the bridge. Oh, Arrow can suck my dick. He's the Secretary of War, not the Secretary of Bridges. Uh, let's go have a look-see. I go high. Nah, it's not that bad. Let's give it a try. What's that sound? Stop whining! Start moving! <gasps> you smell that? Shit! It's gonna
worth our time, Chester. You could use a hand!
Jesus. Christ. <coughs> Worst damn barbecue ever. Hey, boyo, guess who's... I can smell you, Chess, you lousy skunk.
Get that son of a bitch! Young Rent here. Still on your father's leash, I see. <laughs> Heard you were on your way to the gathering, Chess. What's this? Catering? Why, I have no idea what you... <laughs> That big shiny ball out there is no good for your sensitive skin. The sun's not to know what they'll do to me. Fun game. Let's test that theory. No, no, no Richard, uh, stop! Belmontville! The, the gatherer's in Belmontville! Excellent choice, Chester. And since you're feeling so damn helpful, we're gonna be needing a guide. Consider it a promotion. Give shit. Belmontville's a long way from the manor. We're on a clock here. We've been hunting Debano for three months. What's another few hours? <sighs> have it your way. But your father's gonna have your ass as an ashtray if we don't make that presentation. You're retired. What's he gonna do? Fire you? <laughs> Belmontville Mines, huh? Oh, we're gonna be walking blind into a damn maze. And if our tick friend here is telling the truth, the Bono's gonna be right in the middle of it. I don't think I'm in a position to lie, do you? <laughs> That's the spirit, Chester. Now you lift those fancy illusions, and who knows? Maybe you'll make it out of this after all. The glamour! I... <laughs> Even I have my limitations, Mr. Gravener. You want a limitation? How about walking around without a head? Crawling with familiars. No question. <laughs> and where do you think you're going? Judging by that tone of yours, Sounds like I'm making sure Fancy Pants here doesn't make a run for it. In broad daylight. That's why we need familiars. I'm starting to question your qualifications for this job. Those ass licking. <laughs> Tick lovers should be shot on sight. Ah, what the hell. Maybe we can play with dynamite out here too. Right, Jess? I'll make you a new waistcoat. I don't believe my tailor would like that. See? You're bonding already. Ah, eat me! That gathering won't find itself, you know? Move it. You know the can is right there in front of you. Oh, shut up. I told you my sight's not recovered after the change. Hey, so you're telling me it's not the blues? Much better. Huh? 
teach you manners! your head on a wall! Must be close by. Okay. about right. Dead end. Great. Hmm? You seeing this too? Take it off. Mr. Rentier, on a first date? What do you take me for? You're right. Maybe a little light to set the mood. No, no need. I see it now. Of course. The glamour. I'm on it. Hmm. Today, Chester. Please. I need to concentrate. It's not that easy to sever the illusion from its source. What's the source? You don't want to know. I'll take the explosives, you get to Bono. Is this about the bridge? It's not, <laughs> not about the bridge. Got the damn train. Wing it! Stop you!
I've seen my share of tech architecture, but that, that's something. It's hot. enough. It's huge. When did they build this? And how? Let me die! 
this evil. their little party. Might be more powerful, but they will crush us with their numbers. Listen to the voice of reason. Enough. Your lines first to all out war with the humans endangers us all. Peace of Navano. Without the shoe. The wolves go hungry, yes. But the day is coming. When the sheep will outwit the wolves. Haven't you been watching, brother? The humans have harnessed the power of steam and lightning, and they grow mighty. If our hubris allows us to grow fat and lazy in the shadows, they will soon have the power to hunt us down like dogs. <sighs> And so, you propose war. War suggests there is a chance we might lose. I propose we strike with my new asset. We can control the change. Reclaim the Sanguasuja's rightful place at the top of the food chain. Control the change. Are you mad? Even suggesting such a thing is blasphemy. Dominic, brother, these are blasphemous times. While my methods may very well be at variance with our tradition, I can tell you one thing. If we don't adapt, we will perish. Enough. I will not allow you and your bastard greed to, to lead us into annihilation. Peter Davala, the 
top of a high crime of conspiracy against your own kind. I sentence you and your line to the true death. I told you, Father. They wouldn't listen. He had to try, Felicity Mikara. Our work will be a lot easier if we can help them understand. If we can't... Then... we... FORCE THEM TO! Think you could have brought a bigger knife? Some people get a gold watch when they retire. I got Susan here. <laughs> Should have asked him how to get out of here. Too late. He won't be of any use for a month or two. Wait. What about Chester? Well, what are you going to do? Now that 
is how you shape an explosion. Damn, we're late. Now at least we won't be going back to the manor empty-handed. Oh, I'll be damned. That's a new way to spend taxpayers' money. James Harrow. The people's hero. <laughs> I heard the White House sends him golden toilet paper. As long as he keeps the presidential ass clear of tick trouble. Feed him well. We've got a lot of ground to cover tonight. You're not staying for the presentation? The whole institute is in town. Uh, I'll pass on the corporate back padding session. I don't need another retirement lecture. Here, take this to your father before it wakes up and starts cursing us all to high hell. Great, so I'll just tell him you've traded killing vampires for swilling cheap bourbon? Tell him whatever you want. Fine, skip the presentation. But you ain't getting away from a final drink with me afterwards. Home sweet home. Mr. Rent here? At ease, boys. My father in his office. Grave nurse with you? He sends his regards. He's afraid you'll try and talk him out of retirement again. I don't believe either of us want that. You know he did risk his life to get this for you. That's Harrow's trinket. I'm sure you'll both be rewarded accordingly. Edgar isn't some civilian looking for a medal. This is all he knows. Your institute saw to that. My institute? <sighs> this isn't about Agent Gravener, Jesse. We are on the cusp of great progress. Great change. Today's presentation is of critical importance to the family. After which... Edgar is family. After which... I expect you to step up to your duties here at the manor. With all due respect, Director, I am a field agent, not a paper pusher. You're a rentier! <sighs> Why must you always make me spoon-feed these things to you, Jesse? There are bigger things at work here than running around in caves slaying beasts. I do believe someday soon you will see it my way. And if you don't, it's my responsibility to force that change. Now, leave me be. I must prepare for the presentation. And send someone in here to clean up this mess. Mr. Rittier, Agent Feathers is waiting for you in the lobby. You're just in time. The presentation should be starting soon. What do you got for me this time?
Edgar and Heavy. This is huge. Did you see that airship? All the big shots from DC don't come here for no reason. Word is, the director's gonna show off a new version of the gauntlet. But, I mean, you didn't hear that from me. From my friend. Even or Good to see you back, sir. Gentlemen, uh, gentlemen, if you'll take your seats. And, uh, <laughs> welcome. Yeah, I'm Assistant Secretary of War, James Harrow. President Cleveland wants you to know how appreciative we are of the vital service the Rentier Institute performs, defending our great country from monsters of all shapes and sizes. He also wanted me to make sure you're not blowing all our money on Mexican Monty. But that's another conversation. <laughs> yes, quite. Well, uh, as I say, keep up the good work. God bless you all, and uh, God bless America. Thank you all for gathering here tonight. It's rare we gather in such numbers, but I believe great progress calls for momentous celebration. Our efforts in the fight against the Sanguisugia's spread have too often been baffled by the creature's most insidious weapon, their so-called glamours. These impenetrable illusions have allowed countless fiends to slip through our grasp for too long. That ends now. Agent Rentier, we've upgraded the standard field agent's gauntlet with something our science bods have affectionately named the Zapper. Not exactly an elegant name, but it does the trick. When triggered, the Zapper sends out an electrical impulse that shatters any nearby Sanguizu's glamours forthwith, eliminating what is not and leaving only what is. Once finished, these new gauntlets will be distributed to cells nationwide post haste allowing us to sweep our respective territories for glamoured nooks and crannies. This is the beginning of a new age, gentlemen. Armed with this gauntlet, there is no way our enemy can surprise us.
внезапно. Maybe I could string a rope somewhere. Thank Christ. Where's my father? Still kicking ass, last time I saw him. Old fool thinks he's still in the field. Listen, he wants us to destroy the archives before these assholes get their hands on it. You get to it and I'll find Harrow's pampered ass. Meet me out front. Never thought I'd have to blow up my own house.
this. Get him out of here. I got this. Don't be cross with me, Father. I couldn't leave you at the mercy of these savages. You not do that, you fleshy toad! You nearly hit him. Stop blabbing, you're gonna be fine. I know what I'm doing. This is the key, Jesse. Don't let it out of your sight. It's all we've got. It's in your hands now. We need to stop! Stop? We need to get the fuck out of here! We need to find a defensive position to hold us over till morning. Then we head to Calico. wife could blow this defensive position over with a wet fart. We need the higher ground. And that's where the sun will hit first. I'll get the horses and we'll stand our ground up there. 